Hi everybody, here's a quick update on the latest release. Um, so with 23.2.42, you should now be able to import WAV files that don't match your looper's requirements. So currently, all the WAV files need to be 32-bit, um, they need to be two channels and they also need to be uh, 44, 100 hertz. Um, so if you try to import a WAV file that doesn't meet those requirements, when you try to use it in your looper, you'll get a kind of bad data error coming in, um, which is a pain because you've got loads of nice 16-bit WAV files from previous loopers. You basically can't use them on the RC600 or the 505. Uh, but now you can. So if I go in here um, in the audio manager for a memory, um, it's 120 BPM. I'll import this 8-bit mono 48,000 hertz WAV file, which just shouldn't work. But now it does. And if I just select 120 beats per minute, select that, that's been imported. If I play it, it should sound like a sine wave for 8 seconds. Which is 8 seconds. Cool. So basically what's happening is when the audio manager is doing the import, it detects that this 8-bit WAV file is the wrong format. Um, so it does some conversions and it creates this underscore RC WAV file and that's the one that it actually imports. So it doesn't destroy your old file, it creates a copy of the right format, then imports that. Um, so hopefully... This should work for all you guys that have been trying to import WAV files and gone bugger, it don't work. Cool. Thanks everyone. Talk to you soon.